Hello everyone, I wanted to update you on what we're doing. We got some goodies over here we're gonna to get to in a second, but I wanted to show you that we're getting this duct work done for this fan. The internal uh, bearings for the internal shaft came in already, so we're gonna get those taped up and snug, make sure everything fits nice. And uh, I use this really, really thin silver tape right here. This works great for holding those bearings together. It also great for, works great for making them snug, especially around PETG that is normally print out the same volume as something that would be CNC. So we got to watch out for that. <clears throat> so what we're going to do over here, obviously, is I got myself some epoxy resin. I've got some brushes, a lot more than that, but, uh, and I also got this fiberglass tape. So what we're going to do is basically reinforce all the seams where the body parts do come together. They're also going to go around here after we get the carbon fiber spars that go in for support so we can seal everything up and make make it all one piece. And then we're going to get it all epoxied up and it's going to look nice and clean. So anywhere I know I think I need a little bit of reinforcement, that's going to happen. Probably going to be on the inside more than the outside just so it looks a little bit cleaner out here it'll have to be on the outside obviously but it will reinforce that joint even with that carbon fiber spar in there so that is the plan going forward and we are just about ready to start getting this one seated with the nuts and stuff underneath the uh, underside of the lip here so that we can start put, fitting our ductwork onto it that just it includes, you know, me running the screw through and then pulling the bolt up with some RTV, pulling the bolt back out. And it gets everything ready so I can set the, the shroud, the actual fan shroud, the, the ductwork over the top of the inner casing and get everything bolted together. I needed more of the uh, M416s because that's the ones we ended up using the most of, so that's what I ordered some extra of. And I have uh, all the nuts, washers, and compression compression washers that I need for the deal so that'll work good just like on the first fans assembly so we are coming along printer still going like a madman a lot more to print a lot more to do but we are getting things kind of ready for assembly and reinforcement and wiring and getting the internals set up and the body put together and it's just coming along great and it's going to be a lot of fun and I need a bigger table so stay tuned for more